So, so anyway, welcome back to the stream. Everyone having a nice, relaxing night. What are you doing on computer? Go outside so beautiful! Actually, before we do weird we wear, I, I would like to, uh... This is the perfect image for what we just saw, I think. All right. Anyway, it is uh, really nice. It's really nice to uh, to be here <laughs> after that. That was a really cool thing, that, that 64DD Mario Polygon Studio. I didn't even get a chance to really talk about it or share my thoughts on it. I thought it was very innovative and, and, uh, and, and a lot of fun to fuck around with. And also way ahead of its time for what would be available for shit like that. You know, I mean, Spore was, what, 10 years after that? But we had a lot of fun, didn't we? So much fun that now... Oh, God. Yeah, someone made this. So it's Homelander plus Rem Lazar equals Rem Lazar Lander? I don't, I don't know. looks like uh the, again the dude from twilight princess home lazar hang on a second oh hang, hang on a minute i even have a better logo for this hold the fort stop the presses also desert has been adamant that i show this to you chat So I guess that explains a lot. Um, he's from someplace even higher. Okay, so what was once weird we wear is now more weird we wear. <laughs> Why not? Thank you, Pierre, for this logo. Um, yeah, I've got more of this shit for you. As I said before, you, you'd think there would be an end to it at some point, but no, nope, there's, there's too much, too much left. And that's why I would like to show this to you. I have um, a pack here from Blazing Flare, I believe is the name, and Nari checked it out, so thank you. Thank you all. And instead of doing games in any particular order for this i'm just gonna just choose it random like for example three two one rattle battle i don't think i've done this so this is like what part three or four of of weird we wear you know so we've been doing this a while you would think like i said there would just be none left, but no, there's there's plenty, and there's some good ones, too, or at least some interesting ones that would be worth streaming. Um, again, I'm going in blind for most of these. Choose region. Why is this getting so crusty? Hey, uh, Narold, is there a... Is this because it's loading synchronous, asynchronous? I don't know what's happening here. Um, the speed is at 100%. It's- it, I think the shaders might be fucking with this. It has to, like, load them up. Alright, um, fast action, take breaks. Shake the Wii remote with everything you've got and see how many... whatever that is, I can't- uh, to fill the scale with. This is a video game? This was a game you had to pay for?
This is like something that you would get on your phone and then have to pay a dollar to get skins. Trying to get 69. I don't know, man. Just more shovelware, what can I say? And then there's different levels, too. There's like the rattle rocket, which sounds like a sex toy. Why did it need to know what state you lived in? So Homelander can show up and fucking laser your dick off, I guess? I don't know. You know, I really don't understand... Uh, yeah, all of this is just rattle-related. I mean, there's different levels. I'm sure this was still too much money. Vinny, stop hating adorable weeb games. Well, I want to tell you, I don't like waggling. This has way, way less to do with adorable weeb game and way more to do with A, how much money was this shit? And B, my arm is getting tired already. <laughs> Shake it, huh? This was five dollars? That, though, why am I hearing that? Is it broken? Oh, uh, yep. Yeah, something's broken here. I did not expect corruptions for WiiWare today. No, sir. I don't like it. Didn't expect it, don't want it. I think I played this one already, chat. You'll know when you see it. I'm almost positive I've played this. It's Shoot Tanto, Evolutionary Mayhem. Yeah, I did this one. All right. Just as a quick refresher. Connection has been interrupt interrupted. Yeah, this is the the monkey game where you throw the walnuts. In a second, my uh, the the Wii Mote thing, the receiver is is getting a little wacky at the moment. Chat, it's a little wacky. You understand? So it's like sliding off. No, it's not good. There we go. God damn it. It's- I'm trying to balance it on something, and it's not really... ...doing the job. Should've been a little bit more... ...proactive in getting this thing working before... ...streaming this, but... ...I think it's good now. Okay, we're good. So yeah, it's just the- the golden eye silence PP7 noise. And it's just horribly loud and terrible, and I wouldn't worry about it. Let's move on. You've seen it. Check previous WiiWare stream if you want to see that for more than 10 seconds, even though you just got everything. That's about as much as you're going to get. Vinny, you've probably answered this a million times, or a thousand times, but why no face cam? Oh, it's because I look like Quasimodo?
So penguins? Snowpack Park. I like to think that I followed the WiiWare shit kind of closely, and yet, almost every one of these WiiWare streams, 90% of the games I've never heard of. What the hell? Huh? I'm sorry, I'm trying to figure this out. He's oh yeah, look, it's he's finding shovelware right now. You came here to take care of penguins. Yeah, of course, that's what I'm here for. It, it, this is... it's basically, yeah, Chibi Robo speech. You can zoom out so far. Did I just get slapped in the face by a penguin? Yeah, you can take damage. The penguins actually hurt you. They're little flaps. It's a picture board, but there are no pictures yet. Okay, so I, I guess going in blind... It's, it's kind of not Harvest Moon, but... Vinny, this is made by the Chibi Robo devs. No, oh. Okay. Cool, I guess. Uh, do I have a box now? Can I wear the box? Put it on, dude. Put it on, dude. It says headwear, yet I can't put it on. Alright. Colonel, I'm trying to sneak around the penguins. But I'm dummy cold. You probably put it on the penguins? Okay. Uh, okay, yep, it's, it's cheerful. That penguin is in a cranky mood, be careful when you go near it. Slapped. Slapped the shit out of you. Hesitant mood. Got something for you. This is a penguin's favorite food. Chowfish times ten. One, 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 huh? them? Eat fish. I don't know how much of this I can, like, invest myself in right now on a Sunday stream, but... I guess this is kind of cool if you like penguins and Chibi Robo. 
Press B to throw, okay. Get to feed the penguinos. I like how that penguin just stole the other penguin's lunch. That penguin can eat through the box. This is very impressive. I'm very, very proud of you, penguino. That's, that's nice. Can I just, for a moment, acknowledge that the penguin with legs, the blue penguin, is a little scary, and also probably not a real penguin? We're, we're all... On the same page about that, yes? Okay. I would almost imagine that that particular penguin... ...likes to spy on the other penguins by pretending to be a penguin. Masquerades as three penguins in a trench coat. Vinny, I was in Wildwood this weekend, too. Did you get coerced by the Beetlejuice-sounding basketball guy offering you a free shot? Yeah, yes, actually. The fuck? How did you... Really? Yeah, the dude was like, yo, free shot, free shot. Then there was a the dude... I didn't get a chance to record him. There was a dude who was like, one dollar, one dollar, one dollar, one dollar. And it was like some shitty game where you, you lose, but you spend a dollar to lose. Oh, this is Play This Pit Crew Panic. What the fuck? I like going in without a tutorial for games like this. It's much better. I get it. You take your pit crew waifus and then you have them do specific things to dismantle or adjust or fix things and I get it. It's only we wear, man. Only we wear. What a concept. What a fucking concept. I just want to say that it's a shame that so many of these games are lost to time. And we'll, like, you can't, uh, you can't even play this anymore. I can because I, um, I know John Tendo. Why is there meat? Oh, that's not supposed to be there. I get it. It's incorrect. So they have to fix the things that are meat or are a uh, cake instead of an engine. And once you're all fixed up, then you can then you can go. This may have been one of Hudson's last games. No shit. got a cruddy rudder. This is kind of an addictive game. If I shelled out five bucks for this, you know, 10, 15 years ago, whatever, I, I would have probably in enjoyed this a bit. It's not bad. It's kind of a unique concept. Um, also, they get in the way, so you kind of, you kind of can't see the stuff that needs fixing. Oh, they fall over! <laughs> Wait, what's next? What are you doing? You got that? Oh, okay. Alright, we'll do, um, we'll take a look at the next thing, whether it's a car or a tree or it's a giant motorcycle. Fuck. V 
very interesting game that was. Utterly bizarre, but that's the point. I really like that WiiWare has so much variety. And some of these games, you don't see. Like, concepts like that, you don't see unless you do see them um, on mobile devices that are just littered with ads and are, like, predatory. And... Yeah. It's MIDI. So this is called A Monsteca Coral Monsters vs. Robots. God game? Uh... Uh-oh. Camera's fucked. It, it's it's kind of like Doshin the Giant. It's like a rip-off of Doshin the Giant, kind of. But yeah, uh, something was wrong with the camera there. Blazing says, I couldn't really figure out what the fuck I was supposed to do in this game when I sent it to you. Did you go through the tutorial? Because I'm certainly not doing the tutorial. Here's the trick. Here's the trick. You can't complain about not knowing what to do if you don't go through the tutorial. So anyway, what the fuck do I do? No, seriously though, I, I am so confused. There is a butthole at the top of the screen. Um sure sure is butt. This music sounds exactly like algo music. You know what, though? Algo music is better than this. Just listen. This is Vine Sauce, uh, Algo music. I got sent two, like, separate versions of the Vine Sauce Algo music. One is just better samples, and the other one is, is actually my voice. And that was as loud as I could make it. I, I don't know what to do in this game. Um, again, if there was any kind of tutorial, apparently the dude who sent the pack said there wasn't one. Some kind of god game. Some kind of Doshin the Giant. Some kind of monster. Collect orange friends? Maybe. What are you doing on computer? This is called Boings. This kind of looks like a data design interactive game. Ugh. Well, now it doesn't. Now it just looks cheap. Okay, okay, it's, it's something unique. Utilizing the motion controls properly, that's, that's good. Yeah, that's fine. I like how, um, during the WiiWare era, so many games tried to be the next World of Goo, which was a runaway success. And pretty much everyone I knew had World of Goo on their system. Yeah, it kind of is like getting over it. 
by Bennett Foddy. I can't get over the fact that, yeah, they do look like condoms. It's a bit weird. You're trying to establish, like, a brand new IP, brand new character, and you end up just creating condoms instead. Alright, let's keep moving. There's so many games. Too many, even. But... Pretty cool. Bonsai Barber. Now, not to be confused with Bonsai Buddy. The date in the Wii system settings is Sunday... The 22nd of August, 2027. Yep! If this video still exists exists on the internet in like 40, 50 years, people are gonna be like, wait a minute, what? It'll just be feasible. Okay. You want me to cut Horn's hair? Yeah, sure, I could, yep. Okay. Can you cut the mountain style for me? Yeah, I can do that. I need tools. I'll just borrow the tools, it's fine. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna do scissors. This is kind of awesome. <laughs> I, I, this is this is insane. This is what you want, right? <laughs> Four stars. Going for that five star. Yep! Oh, this, this is great! I would have loved this. It just goes to show you, like, I've never even heard of this game. And this would have been, like, a really cool game to have on my Wii. Oh, dear. Screwed up. I went from five down to four again. Ah, don't worry about it. We'll just gong it. You are really good if you use the mallet. Uh, yes, I want to use the mallet. I want to cut one more fruit. Oh, I, you actually have to swing the Wiimote, for fuck's sake. Oh, it's a vegetables. <laughs> it's not fruit. It's a... <laughs> Maisie? Oh, I get it, because maize corn. Yeah, I get it. Catnip. Okay, so you want a pompadour, huh? Oh! Sorry, bird. <laughs> yeah, I did a couple times! Couple times! That's right!
bird's fine. That's a, that's a very resilient bird. Mm. Vinny, this game used the Wii message system in a really interesting way. The veggie sent postcards to your Wii menu. I, I don't understand. I thought this was gonna be like... Trash WiiWare. This stuff is, is good. Some of it. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Burger Time World Tour. I think I remember hearing about this. The long-awaited sequel to Burger Time that nobody asked for. Creep. Fire up the drill. So, uh... Here I am, playing Burger Time, and chat is still... Horny for the cherries from the previous game. Anyway, Burger Time was a uh, Nintendo game, NES game, and I don't think... I think it was arcade too, right? And I don't think it had anything since the NES until this. Which there were a couple other games that had some. Hang on a minute. People are saying this is Kevin McLeod music. Is that real? Let me not get destroyed by a hot dog. God damn it. I actually don't really know how to play Burger Time. Good. Garden party? You just run across the top of Berg. Yeah, it looks like it. Uh, yeah, it's... It, oh, you can throw Pepper. I forgot about that. That's another thing. It's the mortal enemy of food. Pepper. It's burger time! You make burgers. It's fine. It's burger fine. Carnival King? If this is anything like I've played on Sunday Stream uh, Shovelware Showcase, this is going to be a, a mini game collection themed around a carnival. Which... There's like seven Wii games I've played that are that. Welcome to Carnival King. How many players today? Oh. Where would you like to go? Oh god. Uh, I guess we'll go to Arcadia. Nice crusty JPEG you got there. Knock him over. That's exactly that. Oh, it's these things. Shoot the sets of cats. The challenge is on. Pull trigger to start. Excellent! I don't think the dude doing the VA is a native English speaker, but he's damn close. You got him. Hit the clock. One more time. That's it. Nice job. Oh, the clock. Paper running out of time. All clear. None left. Time's run out. He sounds bored. I sound bored. It's fucking... 
your basic carnival shit. Welcome to Carnival King. Choose your destination. Dreamland. We'll go to Kirby's Dreamland, I guess. Uh, it's just shoot. A haunted hunt. Haunted Let's try hunt. that one. That that sounds at least like something. Man, look at these assets. Shoot the sets High detail, targets. quality, Full and good. To start. Blast the spider. Oh, it's so bad. It's the same fucking game every time. Time is running out. Get all the witches. Time is running out. <laughs> the witches are made of metal. Oh, shit. Yeah, it again, I've played carnival games. This isn't that. Welcome to Carnival King. It's a much Where would you uh, like to cheaper go? Lagoon Park. carnival game. Because, you know, it's it's WiiWare, so it probably cost less. I'm not Shoot saying the carnival games I've played were high away. quality by Full any means, but... Start. Yeah. Hit the clock. Ah, precious time. I think Twilight Princess has a minigame that's better than the whole of this. Hurry up. If I'm not mistaken. More time. Ah, uh, precious time! Five arcade gems? Did you ever play Link's Crossbow Training? Link's Crossbow Training is the one Zelda game I don't own. I say Zelda. It's... It, it's got Link in it. It's got Link in it. What about Faces of Evil? I think someone gave that to me. Like, I'm pretty sure I got that at a convention, and it's a, in a box somewhere. So I think I own the Zelda CDI games. Which is just unnecessary. Jungle Pizza Delivery. That's fine. Just, that's fine. What a concept this is. All right. So. Uh, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? Also, is that the Indiana Jones font? The yellow guy is Vinny. Oh, that is- that is actually me! I thought you meant I was playing as that character. No, that is me. I am that dude. Oh. Wrong thing. Oh well. Did I just hear Shikaka? From Ace Ventura? No, right? Definitely not. They didn't just steal that clip from Ace, did they? So I'm drawing from different folders, by the way. There's uh, three folders. There's good folder, there's just okay, and there's mediocre. So, the, like, best, good, just okay, rather. <laughs> Balloon Pop Festival. Ah, uh, let me type my name. Crown toothpaste. Story mode. There's a story mode here. In a distant galaxy, far, far away, there's a beautiful planet called Earth. Wait a minute. Far away from the Star Wars galaxy? 
The people on Earth live together very happily and celebrate a variety of festivals to honor their planet. But one day... I think this game takes place in the Star Wars galaxy. And they're explaining it the opposite of what Star Wars says in the beginning. Yo, Eggman! I've had enough of the story, thank you. Let's see, let's see what kind of gameplay props up this, uh, tremendous story. Oh, it's one of these. Huh? Oh, you can combo and... Yep. Yeah. yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, it's like Puzzle League or Tetris Attack, but you can you can do more. And it's worse. <laughs> I find limitations in puzzle games to be kind of good. But yeah, you can move them in any direction and all that stuff. Um, how about this one? How about you, me, and the cubes? I'm bored. That was boring. You, me, and the cubes. Apparently, this is a good one. What the fuck? A pretty good presentation so far, aside from the bizarre thing that we just saw. Cube one. 100 seconds to Phallos? Phallus? Stop the- The tutorial is mandatory to even understand this game. You have to shake the cube? <laughs> Vinny, keep rotating, you are almost there. I'm pressing the button, yeah, the Wiimote on the... In the corner there, it, it's got... Lights... Point at the screen. Why are you confused, chat? You don't get it?
<laughs> oh, I see. Oh, okay, they're alive. They're good. No, 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 don't die. Okay, I get it. I get it. Hang on. Just hang on. W one Phallos. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, yep, 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 yep. Balance the cubes. That's what you must do. Again, I, I kind of love being dropped into a game and not having any fucking idea what to do. Because when I discover what to do, it's, it's like, rewarding. Oh, Mar Marf. Uh-oh. Oh, one of them died. That's what makes WarioWare so great. Agreed. Yeah, I love WarioWare for that exact reason. Good. You just killed all your people. Okay, now that was a perfect play. That, not so much. Good enough. This game is fucking weird, I like it. You gotta be, like, galaxy brain, big brain for, uh, for this kind of, but I'd, I'd recommend it. If you get your hands on this, and you like shit like that, Pretty cool. Very unique concept, good execution, um, and very minimal presentation, but for a WiiWare game, why the fuck not? Perfect. Clear. Critters Roundup by Konami. Oh, God. I watched a video today about... because it just popped up. Oh, wait, no. Someone sent it to me. It was about PT. And how it was not, in fact, a preview for Silent Hills, but it was a way of Kojima saying he disapproved of Konami's incompetence. I don't remember the name of the video, but it was it was at least interesting. It was good conspiracy theory um, stuff. Someone said, what, how? How about this? I know it sounds ridiculous, and it might very well be ridiculous, but I'm going to link it in chat. And you can determine for yourself. At the very least, it's not a conspiracy theory video necessarily. Like, the dude's not saying, oh, this is definitely it. But, I think it is a very interesting video. And worth... Certainly worth a couple minutes of your time. It's called PT's Hidden Meaning by The Great Debate. There it is in chat. Check it out. PT's Hidden Meaning by The Great Debate. Have fun. I enjoyed the video. Anyway, Konami inspired me. Seeing the word Konami. It, it's, it's been a while since I've seen the word Konami and had fuzzy feelings. Oh, it's this fucking thing. It's Jez Ball. But, like, a worse version of Jez Ball that's, like, way less responsive. Thirty to fifty feral hogs. What about feral sheep? What about Will Ferrell playing a sheep in his new movie, Sherlock Holmes 2?
Boring. Uh, Dracula Undead Awakening is next. Just play Jez Ball or any other version of that. What a logo. Uh, that is a seal of quality. When you see that, you know you're in for a quality, high quality game. Um, so this is Dracula game. So we'll... we'll... That's me. Alu Ard. Uh, I didn't realize that the ass could be in front. Boy, that looks fucking unnatural. <laughs> you would think this is a corruption, but nope. This is just what the game looks like. Totally normal, totally natural movement. Now, son, we gotta fight Dracula together. Just have a little bit of faith, Arthur. I don't know, Dutch. I don't, I don't know if we can kill Dracula, let alone jerk him off. Son, have faith. There's mangoes in that castle, Arthur. another low effort uh just low quality bad game i mean it's functional it's just again also look at the textures everything has to be like crisp and grungy and, and textury yep Van Helsing with a fucking minigun. Walking with his ass facing forward. is noob. The hallmarks of 2009. Grungy textures. Everything is like crisp. Ass backwards. And then, of course, calling your player a noob. What? Drill Sergeant... Sorry, let me read this properly. Drill Sergeant Mindstrong? Look at- look at the face! Look at- look at his face! So, that looks like Arlie Aramie. That is super Full Metal Jacket. Oh! How the fuck do you- do you make a game like this? You will speak only when spoken to your first words- first and last words will be sir. You had better flex your head and start radiating genius or I will skull fuck you, private pile! Oh, 
Who in the name of fuck would make a game on the boot camp section of Full Metal Jacket? Well, I know that Full Metal Jacket isn't... <laughs> Just... <laughs> Yes! <laughs> I will skull fuck you, private! It's, it's just not as good unless the drill sergeant is cursing. Okay, shooting the drill sergeant. Again, full metal jacket. His face is getting purple. <laughs> this, this face is just next level. What the fuck is that, Private Pile? I, I love the drill sergeant's fuming mad face. Also, look when 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 the whistle happens, the whistle is coming from his face. Okay, this drill sergeant is very sadistic and unprofessional. We're sending a private out behind the targets? Really? That's the punishment? They could die! Your punishment is to die, Private! I'm just tr I'm trying to shoot the drill instructor, it doesn't happen. I'm not even trying. I'm really not even trying, I'm just- just whatever. Hang on, let me- let me shoot one of the Privates. Oh, I'm running around now. That's me. I am being punished. Holy shit, Private. You just killed one of your comrades! Did you just say comrade? Oh, shit! Again, bizarre. Really fucking bizarre game. Whoa, someone in chat just dropped some information. I don't know if it's true. This officially was funded by the U.S. government and given out at schools across America in the form of a card. The form of a card with a redemption code on it. What? No. Come on. How the fuck would that game even be in, in any universe designed to recruit people to the military? That, that was... Opposite. All right, my name is Squite, and we're gonna do some work. Is it really that surprising? I don't know. Maybe. I could. Sad thing is, I kind of believe it. What the f- 
fuck? So, Eco Shooter Plant 530 is the name of this. Cool. Accidentally doing the wrong thing. I don't even- you know what? Vinny, they're thinking of America's Army. I remember that. Whatever, that- that game was... I don't know. Fish them all. Yeah, the weird thing about that previous game is the A button went to the main menu, or rather, it was the pause button, and then you could very easily and accidentally, um, press the wrong option. Fish them all. Oh, great. Got Waggle. I just realized something. If you combine all of the games tonight during the WiiWare, um, segment, you just get a Mario Party. Just theme it around Mario. The drill sergeant would be Toad, and it would be, like, cute. When I was in Wildwood the other day, I walked into uh, one of them one of them stores. It was like a record store. It was like one of those commercialized like um, it was like a tattoo parlor. But it was it was clearly appealing to a very specific market. It's supposed to be so cool, like free and purified, my man. But you go in there and they're playing. Um, For those about to rock, we salute you. And I just started laughing. Fire! Like, I like that song, but now I can't help but think of Toad. In another dimension, in a time that doesn't exist, it is year 0001AH. Okay. Robot? <laughs> Look at this! This guy's amazing! <laughs> the, the, midi funk is my new favorite genre. Vinny can confirm the site is still up. For the Sergeant game, link is on the Wikipedia page. Really? Eh, kind of boring. Wait, did... Um, yeah, well, I mean, that's the mojo thing, like Austin Powers mojo. Yeah, baby. Triple jumping sports. This is in the best folder. Again, I, I apologize if anyone wants to see more of these games and I'm going very quickly. I'm... I kind of just get bored of some of them. Like, there's not really a lot to see with a couple. And you just kind of know what you're in for for the rest of it. What the fuck is with this dude's face? God, that's scary. That looks like my Kirby from earlier a little bit. <laughs> 
Kenzone is now this dude's name. So there's pole vault, high jump, and long jump. We'll start with long jump. Should've went with A-Train? Oh, yeah. Or Shockwave. He's in the audience, he's watching. That face. Here we go! Here we go! Jump! Go long! That face, though! <laughs> oh, that fucking face! I can't! I can't- I can't deal with it. Going fast! Here we go, Michael, so much! Wow! That was shit. Like, let's be real, okay? If if you're gonna play a game about jumping on WiiWare, not bad. I just want to see the faces. I really like the faces. I think it does what it has to do. It's you know, it's a game that makes your arms and wrists really tired, which is a perfect simulation. <laughs> Of of the running experience, of course. That is a cool face you got there, mate. Yeah, yeah, animation's natural. Yeah. Uh oh. All right, and now the running version. We don't need to spend too much time on this. It's the same thing, it's, it's really just, yeah, it's the same thing. B train. There he is, John USA. Are you Mark? Guess what? Go. I don't really feel like waggling. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah! Just not gonna move? Just gonna stay perfectly still? Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, God, for giving me these face shots. I'm going with the lack of the stamina. Here's the last game in the, uh, good collection. Vinny, right after you said, for those about to rock, my power went out. Are you proud of yourself? Okay, I'm gonna do it one more time. Anybody in the audience, just pay close attention to your surroundings. 
and see if anything weird happens after I say it. You ready? The nose about to rock! Ah, we salute you! You got diarrhea, anyone? Someone said my cat just vomited. I got turned into a new! Anyway, violin paradise. What? I have to play the Ave Maria? Vinny, that gave me the urge to shit. Oh. Oh, I have to play this like an actual violin. I'm holding it. <laughs> I'm holding it like a violin. <laughs> Strange. I, I am mesmerized by this. What is that thing in the distance there? Did I win? Uh, I won. I did fine, I guess, on the cello. Wow. Vinny, are you going to get copyright claimed by God? You know, that's the thing. I, he, he, even he needs money. Sometimes, you know, you... Sometimes... They just need... Uh, a little bit of cash. They get strapped for cash. I can't play much more of this, but... Uh, this is surprisingly... This is surprisingly good. The music is pretty good, too.
I finally figured it out. It gets nutty. Okay, all right. I've had, <laughs> I've had enough. Wow. Uh yeah, that was that was surprising. Sorry everybody. I I had to I had to because it was starting to hurt my wrist again. But that might just be because old yacht. But very good. Very good. Fuck, I don't know. Um I guess we could do some getting weird with it stuff now, if you want. Maybe I'll do, like, one more? I'll do one more with a really cool name. Play with birds. <laughs> that, to me, is a cool name. Which also means, by the way, that there will be another part to this. Just because, um, there's just so many fucking WiiWares. But I'd like to at least do some of the getting weird with it. If not all of it. Bingo! Why, why does that one bird have midnight eyes? I don't like that. Great. Got a shake. Oh, yes, I'm a bird. The a musculature. Look at me, I'm a bird. Yeah, never in my life did I expect to be playing an open world bird game, but, you know. Gotta use uh, the gyro on the Wiimote to actually control this fucking thing. Press one to drop ooh on thief. Oh, oh, fuck. Sorry, policeman. Reloading. Great hit. That's right. Do it doing the work that the police can't do. You know, they, they don't have the ability to shit on the thieves. Also, this is- I love the- the stereotypical burglar. I love the outfit. I- I love the- the janky walk. I- everything about stereotypical thief, or aka burglar, the mask, uh, it's all so great. Because as soon as you dress like that, you instantly give away that you're going to burgle. So it is the worst, the world's worst uniform for the profession intended. I'm pretty sure you're you're good now, police officer. You you got him. Why can't they just call it poo? Why do they have to call it ooh? I guess we don't do sound effects in this game.
you know, weirdly enough, the game doesn't look too bad for WiiWare. It's not... It's not good. Just, again, there's, there's just a little extra level of polish. Yet there's no, um... There's no sound effects. Is that a baby up there? Oh, that's another bird. There's an invisible wall right here. I can't go any further than this. Vinny, you have this upscaled. True, but even without the upscaling, I would say that this is a slightly better WiiWare game visually than a lot of the other ones I've played. There's, there's almost even a little bit of a style to the houses and stuff, but it's just, it's ooh. The game is ooh. Oh, that was all minigame. I get it now. It's like, you know when you're watching a movie and they do a dream sequence, but they don't explicitly tell you that it's a dream sequence or a flashback? That was that. Except I knew I was in a minigame, and I even had a timer. I ignored it. Well, I, I tried to find something to do. It's just minigames and open-world bird shit simulator. Um, and yeah, no, the music is definitely driving me crazy. Now you're all going to have to hear this in your fucking nightmares. Anyway, thank you everybody for watching. That's the collection for now. Got probably one more WiiWare ahead of us, and I don't know if there's any other WiiWare segments left after that. Like, seriously, I've said this several times by now, but we're really reaching the end of the WiiWare. Sure, there's some good stuff. There's stuff that you all know about. There's stuff that is, like, relatively famous, like Castlevania The Adventure Rebirth. There's the Final Fantasy IV game. Um, Contra. I'm not playing that stuff. But we'll definitely do more. Uh, one more weird WiiWare. What about Homebrew? Well, I've had... I've done Homebrew at some point. Years ago, I did Homebrew. I just don't know uh, if I do a segment. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Sure. Wait, is that... Did he not sing that in key? Did he Did he sing off pitch? Kind of. Nah, he, this is good. He put a little mustard on it. I like that. He's fine. Rem Lazar is a good singer. Very good singer. <laughs> 